Hey there, friends. Thanks for checking in. I have said several times that people leave the best comments. I learn a lot from this channel. People ask questions. All of that is welcome. And I continue and encourage people to do that. The dialogue is amazing. And I learn a ton from the viewers of this channel. But what inspired this video is the random commenter that shows up out of nowhere just to leave a hateful comment. And this week's YouTube comment of the week comes from a guy named Sky Raider 8 He took exception to my last video when I shot a bowling ball with the 350 Legend. And now, I don't know what brought him to the video. I don't know why he clicked on the video. Maybe he's a fan of the 350 Legend, but he decided that I did that wrong. And the reason I did that wrong is because it was unsafe. He left a comment that said, did anyone ever discuss gun safety with you? Never shoot into water. That includes round objects. Now I'm not certain how round objects and water are one and the same, but let's move on. You are very unsafe and causing problem for safe shooters. So I guess by me shooting the bowling ball, which is very interesting by the way, I've shot several bowling balls and I, I've learned that the, the inner core of the bowling balls are vastly different and the rounds either penetrate or they don't and, and that's what we found with my last video with the 350 legend but he finishes by saying shame on you now when i've watched and when i've shot into water okay usually a downward motion i've never seen a bullet skip back up you know when you're shooting down into the water it typically has enough energy to make its way into the water. It's not something that I would advise, but it does happen on occasion. People do it. They may be trying to shoot at something or just trying to have a good time. I kind of either way with that one. But when, when shooting a ball, I'm not sure what's so unsafe about that. Okay, the ball was set into a very large, tall, wide, and dense berm that was just filled with all this dirt and dirt typically when you shoot into dirt a lot of times you can just reach your hand in there and pull up a stack of, of bullets because it usually goes about a foot maybe a foot and a half into the berm to begin with but when you shoot a ball it may ricochet a little bit but that's why the ball was set into a berm way up there way taller than I am way wide there is no a dangerous way that this bullet from the 350 legend could have caused any problem so as I shot right. it it did exactly what I thought it would do make contact with the ball I'm not worried about ricocheting off and, and hitting me a hundred yards away or somebody who was nearby which there was nobody I'm not worried about it skimming off of the ball and hitting into the berm because that's what the berm is there for so that's a hateful comment and he follows up by saying shame on you one thing i've noticed is that a lot of the people they want to condemn the person who makes the video and they have to finish off with something like shame on you you ought to be ashamed of yourself you don't know anything you know you need to quit making videos you're a bad example for everybody else you're nothing but a fud you're an idiot you're a bleep 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 and by doing that that may just get you on the youtube comment of the week so sky raider 8 you know it's a shame that you're so much against shooting uh, around into uh, bowling balls or any other type of balls I, I fail to see your point there but i will mention that i am going to shoot into that very same bowling ball by uh, heavy requests from the respectful viewers of this channel and then next time i'm going to hit it on the side that is not damaged and i'm going to hit it with a 308 if you like videos like this please subscribe and share i always appreciate thumbs up button thanks for watching and you guys be safe